is this concept of neuroplasticity. The other thing that you mentioned in your, in your book, the concept that we can retrain our brain physiologically seems like nonsense. You know, I can't change my arm. Your brain. You can't change your arm. No, you work out. That's true. When you work out, you're building muscles in your arms. Mm -hmm. And that same exact process is exactly what happens inside our brains. And it's called neuroplasticity. In your brain, what actually happens, again, like computers, it's almost as if you loaded a new uh, piece of software, a new, a new piece of operating system. Literally, for every one of us listening, uh, everyone listening to us to, uh, right now, at the end of this conversation, their brain will be wired differently than when it started. Every single instance of anything that you do literally rewires the hardware itself, okay? The problem with neuroplasticity is if you tell your brain to wire for tapping your finger, it will. If you tell it to wire for solving complex mathematical equations, it may take a little longer, but it will. If you tell it to wire for hating people, it will become very good at hating. If you tell it to wire for fearing the end of the world because of what the media is telling you, it's gonna become very good at fearing the world.